Then there is the second day is where Narakasura was killed. Now Narakasura was the one who was the devil from the hell, they say. Very cunning, very clever and he was killed by the goddess. Actually he was killed by a, another incarnation, Kartikeya, but goddess gave him the power to kill. So when he was killed, it was celebrated because the evil was killed. But we don't find that. These days the evil people are getting peace uh, awards. So what is the reason for this kind of a perverted brain? How is it they are using perversion? Just the opposite of it. What has worked out these things? So again we find the same so-called freedom to become also evil. So we have freedom to become evil. First of all, we have freedom not to be benevolent and secondly, to become evil we have freedom. So the Narakasura within us must be killed, the one which teaches us evil, to do, do evil to others. If you are busy doing evil to others, you can never enjoy because you enjoy doing evil to others. So that has to be faced within ourselves, not in other people. It's very easy to say that this Sahaja is caught up, that Sahaja is like that, but very difficult to say, Mother, I am caught up, I have got this problem within myself. So when you start seeing yourself, your heart opens out. Unless and until you learn how to open out your heart, how can you enjoy? Open your heart. Many people live on very superficial level. All right, some of them might say that, I am possessed mother, I've got this position. But why? I've got this conditioning, that conditioning, but why? You don't want to enjoy. So watch yourself, see for yourself, this is my conditioning, all right, I'll put you right. See in the mirror, tell yourself, this kind of a useless conditioning, I've got it from where? Because I'm Indian, because I'm French, because of English. Open the heart. And opening the heart is only possible if Narakasura sitting on your heart is killed, finished, once for all. In small, small things there is joy. In very little things also there is a ripple of joy. If you are sensitive, you can catch it. Oh, why not enjoy? Why to have this stupid conditioning on our heads for nothing at all that we can't enjoy? Enjoyment is only possible if you take out this one sitting on your heart. So, that is the second part of the Diwali, that you have to open your heart. When should we fast? When we should not fast? For example, Naraka Chaturdashi, we should fast. Because that is the day the door of the uh, hell is opened, that's the day, fourteenth day. And all the bad spirits are put by the goddess inside the Naraka. That is the day we should fast and sleep till late, so in the morning we get up and have our baths, just the opposite and eat. See the logic, it should be logical also. You see the logic is, Narka Chaturdashi is the day when he was killed, put in the Nark. Now why do you want to get up early in the morning, eat food, maybe the door is not yet closed. Maybe some of them are lingering and let them all go away, there should be Shuchir Bhut, then we can eat. So this is the trouble with us. All these small, small things, you see, that is how they have made God unhappy. They have made God very unhappy. You should fast only on one day, definitely you must. That is Narak Chaturdashi.
all the rakshasas will be going with the food inside the stomach in the nabi chakra is sir yogi sir going to kill you have to come up to a point and definitely he can be killed when kartikeya is awakened within you he can be killed but for that you have to be just like gold untarnishable you need strong people to do that a sword that can kill him has to come out of your metals then narakasura can be killed